Hello, everybody, and welcome to our October 2022 Couples Tower Isle walkthrough. I am Neil. I am Annalise. Take 794. <laughs> this is the road you drive in when you show up. Uh, right off the top, we want to say we're not affiliated with couples. We don't get paid to make these videos. We just do them for fun. We are going to cut across the lobby. The lobby is there to the left. We're going to cut across and go to the gift shop first. We didn't know exactly where to throw this in, so we thought we'd just take care of it now. There's a gift shop. It has everything, clothes, hats, sunscreen, medicines. <laughs> Souvenirs, everything you need. Everything you could possibly ever want. So when you arrive, you get let off here at the lobby. There is the tour desk. Um, there is an elevator and some stairs. And over here to the left will be actually the check-in desk. Um, the, there might be some weird angles of how we record simply because if there were, there were people sitting in the lobby and we try not to have anybody in the video that either doesn't want to be in the video or doesn't know they're going to be recorded. So this little thing to the left is where you can exchange money. There is a men's and women's bathroom as well as the little uh, filtered water stand. This is the concierge table. That glass door to the left is the... Wedding office. Wedding office. And here in front of the lobby is the amazing view of the, the island and the freaking Caribbean Sea. <laughs> it's uh, in October, and as you can see, the weather is beautiful, if anybody asks. And that is the natural island, so no clothes. Um, this is a lovely place to sit and enjoy morning coffee and pastry or a nighttime cocktail. So that is the piano bar, main bar. They do music in there. They have the piano sing-along. They do karaoke in there. Um, Top shelf liquor. Top shelf liquor. Moving on, here on the right is the Eight Rivers restaurant. That does require reservations, and it does require long pants and collared shirts for men. Mm -hmm. Over to the left is the... Veranda. Veranda restaurant, which is also sit-down dining. They post the menus. That's what we were showing there. They post the menus for all the restaurants every day so you can see right. what all the restaurants are having. And there's no reservation required for this place. No. And um, you can just come in and dress casual. Kind of Caribbean fusion. It's uh, The food's amazing. Uh, yes. the, the food at this resort is great. Yes. Uh, we list this as our uh, the four couples resorts as, as the number one for food. But again, it, they're very close. I agree. Yes. Um, this is the patio restaurant. This is pretty much buffet for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, and again, really good food. It, again, is the one number one in food, in our opinion. And some you see some where we speed up a little bit. It's just because probably didn't want to take five minutes to walk across. <laughs> so uh, There's a little stage there. They do have live music and dancing here in the evenings, as well as sometimes for uh, breakfast or brunch, they'll have like a violinist and a guitar player yeah, or nice. a cellist or very something. Nice. So here we are walking out to the left is one of the pools. This area right here is where you would get your beach towels or exchange your beach towels. You should have two beach towels in your room when you check in. There are a couple of bathrooms back in there as well. Mm -hmm. So this is the photo shop where you can come and look at the photos uh, that the um, photographers. resort photographers have taken of you. We just blew by the <laughs> coffee shop. Uh, the reason was there were a lot of people in there, but that is the coffee shop right next to the uh, Photoshop. Think of like a uh, a cool little, like a, yeah. I don't want to say Starbucks or Pete's, but yep, something It's a like nice that. little coffee shop. And that we just passed the grill and uh, that's open late and off hours and things like that. That would be your overnight dining as well. Yes. If you want your midnight snacks. I think yes. they open again at 11. 11. So this is the games room. Uh, and the little library, but mm -hmm. they have ping pong, um, pool, they have a TV in here. Oh, an ATM. And yes, the ATM gives Jamaican money because you're in Jamaica. It doesn't give U.S. dollars. <laughs> Just be aware. We, we, we <laughs> heard the complaint of that a couple times. And it was interesting. Right. Um, and all, they often have like, uh, you know, sports games on in the daytime if you want to catch, you know, like... Sports we were, games. Sports games. Like well, it. it could be football. It could be basketball. Sometimes, you know... Could be U.S. Right. football. Could be <laughs> Australian rules, rules football. So here is the uh, multi-purpose room. Obviously, they have spin bikes in here. They do yoga. They do a bunch of different classes in here. They have guest instructors that come well, and teach. Me. So um, just you have to just check. They have a little board of what's happening that day. And then moving forward, we're going to go to the gym. We actually have a gym video that we'll, we'll post 
here up in the corner yeah. where we walk through and show all the um, equipment in the gym. Uh, we didn't walk in now because there was somebody on the treadmill, so we didn't want to bother them. And again, we do have another video for that. So, And so we're going to go down here. Uh, there's some hot tubs. We're, we're going to cruise by that, too. We're also going to walk down to the bay side. The bay side also requires reservations. Um, but I do believe it's resort casual. I don't know if there's a dress it's, yeah, it's res code. It's for resort that. casual. Um, most people dress fairly nice anyway, but uh, but you can go in shorts. And here know. to the right is a couple restrooms. Um, yeah, for the for the pool, you know. And um, the Bayside is what would you call that Asian fusion? Yeah, uh, Asian restaurant. It's kind of Thai fusion. It yeah, is Thai. Yeah, it's. You, and of course, you can look up the menus for these places online on the Couples uh, Resorts website. So, and the Couples uh, Couples Resorts also has a really good app where you can download that. You can use the app while you're at the resorts to uh, do room service or uh, book your reservations. But it also lets you know um, a lot of information about the resort. So even if you're not going or you're looking into it, I'd say check out the Couples app. They have a cool little bar there to the right, and so if, if you uh, have to wait, if you get there a little early for your reservation, you can have a cocktail, mm -hmm. or stay later and have a cocktail, whatever you want to do. It has a really beautiful view, and it's a really cool spot to have dinner. There's so, the bar. There's the bar. <laughs> and these little built-in benches, which are really cool. The This restaurant is, I would say, well, it's hard to say, right. favorites. It's one like of our all. favorites. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of our favorites with the other ones. They're all one of our favorites. Yeah. Uh, this uh, resort has a lot of places to choose from to eat, and it's all very good. So whatever you decide. Considering the size of the resort. Exactly. And again, just showing you the beautifulness of the resort. Yeah, we wanted to uh, take some time to show the views. I know sometimes we do our walkthrough videos. Hey, Hi. there you are. There you are. Hi. <laughs> uh, sometimes we do the walkthrough videos, and we don't actually do a lot of videos of the, the ocean and the And beach. the view, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, so that little thing to the left is not a diving board. It never was a diving board. Right. It's actually a water fountain into the pool. So here's a, a few hot tubs with beautiful views. Yes. Uh, the reason we're walking so funny is there was actually a couple behind us. <laughs> we were uh, giving them some space. Yeah. <laughs> Don't think they cared if uh, they were in the video, but right. like I said earlier, we try not to. Uh, here's a smoking uh, area. Right. And it's also part of the uh, patio grill that's down there, and it's attached to the veggie, veggie bar. bar. Yeah. Yes. But uh, you can always uh, kind of take your plates with you and take them down there and all of that if you so choose. So, so what we're looking at now is where the gym, the grill, the, coffee, the Photoshop, the coffee, coffee bar. bar, that's it. Then there's this pool. This is known as the quiet pool because there isn't a pool bar right. in the pool. However, there However, there's is a bar, bar right here. <laughs> um as, and everything gets cleaned up super well. We we shot this video pretty early, so that's why you don't see the bars open right. and uh, people hanging out. So, again, a lot of weird cuts just simply because there were some people, you know, jogging around the resort. Right. So we are back to in front of the lobby with that first shot where you saw the island. So now we're going to go to the other end of the resort where there is water sports here to our right. We will go down there. There's also going to be the pool with the pool bar. We will be going there too. And the wedding gazebos on the side. We will be going by that as well. <laughs> as you can see, a lot of these uh, rooms are inside this building, but the views face outward or they face inward towards the gardens and spa area. And if you're already annoyed of our voices, go ahead and mute this. Here's a couple restrooms for uh, the, the pool the, down here. Yeah. Go ahead and mute us. Just listen to some reggae. It's still a good video. <laughs> You'll still get the gist. <laughs> Trust me, we get tires of ourselves too. So. <laughs> so here to the left, these are stairs leading up to some of the other rooms. We're going to buzz by here. We're going to buzz by the pool. The pool is to our right, but we will come back to that. But I think first we show the wedding gazebo, mm -hmm. which is here. Lovely uh, grass area, and they will put chairs and tables out there uh, if you so wish. And can get married with that lovely background. And just so you know, the people in the building behind you and the balconies can see you. And uh, although that's kind of fun sometimes because sometimes people will take pictures and send them to you if you so wish. So that's just an FYI. <laughs> so we're going to go here to the end of the property. And if you go here to the left and keep going around, you'd actually go all the way around to the spa, which we will also be going right. to. But just oh, there you are. Again. Hi. 
I like how they hide their little yeah, they, garbage cans and in, stuff. Yeah, they try to the hide bushes. that stuff, you know. So we're going to hurry our butts back here to the pool. There's some service areas back in, if you keep head gone around the side there, you'll also see some service areas because obviously they have kitchens and trashes and things like that, but that's all back there. So here is the pool, the pool deck for the... I don't know if this you would consider this the main pool or not, but it is the pool with the pool bar. I like the sense of stuff. We had nothing else. We yeah, have anything else to say <laughs> about that. Pool, we pool spent bar. a lot of time in there yeah. uh, this last trip. <laughs> um, it's really nice to sit on that uh, balcony. There. Not balcony. The uh, pool deck. Pool deck and look out. It's beautiful. So here we're going to, I believe, we're yes. So we're going to go down. I think we're going to walk down the pier. Mm -hmm. uh, we're also going to show you here in front of us is where the um, water sports is. Yes. But I think first we walk down the pier. Here to our right is where you would catch the boat to go to the unnatural island. Right. Um, they right. do allow you to go to the island for before um, and after. Um, if you want to just go see it. Right. I believe the island is, is it eight to three? I have no Something clue. like that. I'm not, I'm not positive with the hours. Obviously to be I on think the website. think for the amount of times we've been, we'd know, but no <laughs> clue. And again, you can lay out here. You can sit here and, you know, have a cocktail and watch the sunset and all of that. It's beautiful. So you can see, uh, some people had a breakfast, breakfast or, <laughs> or a late dinner or whatever. Again, the resort is kept very, very clean. It's, meticulous most of the time but however from that 2 a.m to like 6 a.m right. uh there isn't a bunch of staff on um on schedule to clean up all the little things that people leave around so right. but as you can see like with the with the video with the, everything is really clean it i think it's around seven ish in the morning and it's really quiet and really clean and the you know the workers have already been out there uh cleaning up so yeah <laughs> yeah yeah. So here's the you water can also sports. Get, yeah, I'm sorry. You can also get towels here at the water sports. Um, this is where you can, you know, sign up for your uh, scuba, snorkel, sunfish, check anything you want out. Again, <laughs> everything's included. So yeah. enjoy. The glass bottom boats and uh, check the times for the uh, sunset cruises as well. So we're now we're walking back towards uh, the bar and the other pool, mm -hmm. the uh, patio restaurant is there to our right. We're going to go down these steps. Here's the beach. And we're going to go to where the lounge is. I I like that these lights are a somewhat new uh, <laughs> addition because I don't know how many times I've hit my head on that yeah, tree. It's, but they don't want to cut the trees down I because still hit it's, my head on it. you know, but it, it, it belongs there. So Here's the lounge. We don't go in there because it, it was closed, but it's a it's an after hours night. Yeah, it's a nightclub. Club. Yeah. Heard it's a lot of fun. Uh, we're too old. Yeah, we don't, we don't we stay never up make that it late. that far, yeah. <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> There's another little smoking area here, mm -hmm. as well as like, you know, the out, outside for the the lounge. Mm -hmm. And we're going to buzz back real quick here. Right. And as you see, there's plenty of beach chairs. They have these uh, sunshades up. Um, so, you, you know, if you want to get out of the sun, not be in direct sun, there's plenty of shaded places. Right. And they, you can take those little floaties on the chairs out to the water and all of that. Down in this little area where we're walking through right now, they have a lot of like the fire dancers and, and the beach party and stuff. Mm -hmm. That's where they have the entertainment. This is the veggie bar. Uh, amazing. Delicious. Again, yep. amazing food. You can even go down there. You can get stuff to go and go back up to the pool or go back up to your room. So now we're heading back to... <laughs> <laughs> we're coming out of the lobby and going to the spa area. Yes. So a uh, hard cut there. Sorry about that. But I didn't think you wanted to walk all the way back. <laughs> so this is, like Annalise said, this is leaving uh, the lobby and heading to the spa area. And again, it's a beautiful resort if you just want to wander around. And all the resorts do uh, nature walkthroughs of the property a couple times a week. So you can check in with them to see if you want to do that. And here's the backside of the balconies there, the right, you can see the garden views. Look over that garden there. So this is the entry to the spa. The spa here is amazing. They actually do, um, uh, you can book like a certain level where you get unlimited spa. Right. And, and I think there you have to book these rooms that we're going to go into. Right, the spa cottages. If you book one of those, I believe, I'm sure, again, as you say, there's tiers and you have to look into it, but it comes with a ton of spa amenities. 
And these are all very private, so we don't um, have pictures of that. So, for people's privacy purposes, we do walk around the back of the spa to take a look at the rooms and the pools and stuff like that. And uh, uh, let me know if the men's has this, Neil, but the women's has a little hot tub and sauna in the. Yes. Uh, yeah, in the, that, in the locker room. That right there, that that slatted fence is actually the men's uh, hot tub in the locker room. Okay, cool. Uh, you can open those slats, which I think you said the women's were open. Right, I was going to use the women's, but it was open, and I wasn't sure if it was okay to close them, so I ended up not going in it, but, you know. <laughs> but you can also, if you're not using the spa services, you can still come use uh, the locker room and the sauna and hang out in the hot and cold yes. dipping pools. You can just come here to be relaxed. It's very quiet. Um, it's very peaceful. It's it's a it's a beautiful little area. Yeah, there's a little bar behind us that uh, serves infused, uh, you know, water and things like that. And it's just a nice place to chill out. Maybe like read, take a nap. <laughs> and that is a plunge pool of some sort, right? I don't remember if that pool is heated or not. I don't recall that. I believe that's the cold pool, but I'm not 100 percent sure. Right. But then again, looking back towards, you can see that, oh, there you are again. Hi. <laughs> that uh, door in front of us to the left of this little bar, that's actually where you would come out from the lobby of the spa. And these uh, blinds are usually open at that bar, but again, the spa is closed. Um, and that's where, like Annalise said, you could get your infused waters and hang out. And now we're going to take a little bit of, of a walk through the gardens, and then we're going to go back to uh, the front. But here on the, the left is is where the birds are. Mm-hmm. And I always forget their names. <laughs> I do, too. Um, there's also, at uh, most resorts in the Caribbean, there are resort cats. And we might see a couple here. Cause... We will definitely see a couple here. <laughs> and there's a little feeding station, so they take care of the cats and feed them and all of that. But they also, you know, just wander around. A, and eat critters. <laughs> there's the birds hanging out. So if anybody has any questions, uh, by all means, you can always email us. Uh, you can get get us through YouTube, or you can always email at us at uh, darkangelsandprettyfreaks at gmail.com. There's a little feeding station. Yeah, there's the cat feeding station. We'll answer whatever questions we can. Uh, we certainly hope you enjoyed the video. We have a little bit more, but I know we're getting to the end. So thanks for watching, and we hope if you do make it to couples that you, ha- you have a great time. <laughs> As you can see, there's some plants and pots. They do a lot of uh, their own gardening and propagating there. So, Yeah, all the, the flowers and stuff for the, the weddings, they grow there as well as a bunch of their... Hi, Katie. <laughs> uh, and also, um, you can see kind of in the background there, that's one of the areas where you know the workers actually have all of their workstations and everything. So, Apparently, I got lost. <laughs> I, was, Katie, I was... Oh, oh I was scared the kitty. I think I was just <laughs> telling you, like, oh, the kitty ran away from me. <laughs> and so now we're just walking back to the lobby and... Showing you the grounds. That's pretty much it. <laughs> Thanks again, everybody. everybody thank you so much for watching we appreciate it if you like the video video would be great if you gave it a thumbs up because that helps us out and if you subscribe to the channel we've been doing drinking video video videos all day so we just thought this would be a good time to make an ending video cheers